Hi, Susan. Hi, Armando. Making his decision known to the UN Nuclear Watchdog Agency. This Bring is them on camera. Minister issued a fresh warning to President Trump today on Twitter. He urged the president not to fall for. Hi, John Mendoza and Colleen Ryan Gallagher. Targeting U.S. troops in Iraq. This is the first time I get to see the names. Sunday is the first anniversary of a U.S. While while I'm uh, doing it, because Morgan's not here, she usually takes over on this. We're getting ready to start the show. Thank you all for watching. I can't seem to do Instagram. Let me see here. Morgan didn't answer my call, so I can't seem to get Instagram going. One last chance. Let's see. I can figure this out. Welcome to the KM Builders Remodeling and Design Show, the first show of the year, and we thank 
Dave, for taking care of the sound back there, and we are looking forward to talking to you live at 737-1200. That's the number here in the studio to get a hold of me. If you send a question on Facebook, I think I'll see it. Can't guarantee it, but let's try it. Um, welcome to all of you that are watching on Facebook Live. I was able to get that going. I don't think I can get the Instagram going. Just uh, not familiar with it enough. So thank you for your patience and hopefully we don't run out of battery here. <clears throat> so today we want to talk about reasons to remodel in 2021. And we're going to, to be able to take your questions on any topic related to remodeling or, or uh, even custom homes, which KM Builders also does. But this show was, was kind of devoted to remodeling because there's so much of it. I'm in a business, fortunately, where almost everybody could use what we offer. Almost everyone. And that's because remodeling is a very broad realm of work, activity. It's a very broad industry. <clears throat> we see people needing maintenance, and some of that maintenance the, um, leads to home improvements, needs to, and we do all of those things, which can be siding, windows, doors, painting, and all that. We are geared up to be able to do all of those things, so we talk about all of that on this show. And we want to help you with your your questions or concerns or your goals of what to do. But 2021 is going to be a great year to remodel. I think one of the first reasons that comes to mind is prices of homes are going up so much. It was a record year in in homes, home values, and what, what folks are paying for homes nowadays. And it just continues to go up. And that's good if you're selling a home. You're going to get more out of it. <clears throat> But you also realize that when you go to purchase your next home, you're going to pay a lot more for that also. So that is the reason that a lot of folks just want to stay where they're at. They can get more for their home, but when they go to see what they can get to replace it, it's just a completely different story than what, than what they were paying for. What we constantly hear is that people will say, well, I could buy another one, but I wouldn't get nearly what I have here. And so that's the reason they decide they want to go ahead and remodel. And we're here to help you with that. Again, if you want to talk live, it's at 737-1200. Or you can try to text to message me on Facebook Live here. We're doing that. <clears throat> and Morgan is out today, which I miss her every time she doesn't go on the show. But I know y'all miss her more because of her giggling and her funny remarks and her good questions and keeping me in line. But uh, she needs some time to take care of personal things on the weekend, like we all do at times. And uh, we're, we're glad to be with you, though. I'm glad to be with you here. Let's talk about some of the reasons that people remodel in general. <clears throat> I guess the first reason is please the wife, right? That's probably the nicest gift you could ever give your, your wife or yourself. And if you give a nice gift to your wife, what happens? Well, it's like giving a nice gift to yourself. And I say that because a lot of men are, are less interested in changing things in their homes as much as the wife is or the significant other. And, and so if that's your attitude and you're listening to me today, realize that um, you could make her very happy. The, the woman's touch on your home is probably the best thing you'll ever do to it for resale and for your own happiness. So don't don't hesitate forever on this. 2021 is a great year to do it. And um, you're just going to see, you've probably already been at home more and you realize that it would make everybody happier to make those changes, whether that be uh, permanent changes or temporary changes, whether it be because of people staying home and working from home whether it be because of people moving into the home that weren't there before, and you've got changes there. I mean, probably at least one of those things is happening to you now, has happened already, or is about to happen. And wouldn't it be nice to be prepared for that and to really to make it a little easier on yourselves while you're going through these things? Um, another great reason to remodel now in 2021 is because 
you're going to be able to get more value out of it and the interest rates are much lower than they had been previously. So the ideal time is to when you can get the most value out of it. When interest rates are lower, when you need it, of course, is one of the big ones. <clears throat> and all of these things are happening at the same time in 2021. They already started last year. And if you didn't take advantage of it, you'll really want to think about it. Let's just talk about interest rates. Interest rates can make it you get a whole completely different remodeling project than you would have been able to afford elsewise. Otherwise, we talk about just recently we did a show on why it's it's so beneficial for you to do more of the projects at the same time. Group them together, you'll save maybe even tens of thousands, but you're going to save a lot of money by doing remodeling all at the same time. And we certainly can help show you how you can break them apart if that's what you want. But you can also see that the financing that you'll pay to get these projects done is much less spent than if you were to break them apart. And then, of course, there's that added benefit of you get all of the products at the same time, you get to enjoy it all, you have less stress because all of your projects are done at once. And many, many clients would tell you that they wish they had done it that way if they didn't. And if they did, they'll tell you that it was certainly the best way to go. They don't want to do it again if they don't have to. So remember that, that all of these things are coming together now at one time. Uh, some people are having these situations hitting them really hard. One of, the, one of the shows we're going to do soon is going to have to do with how to remodel for universally for anyone in the home. And that might be an age parent and so people are giving a lot of thought to parents being out in nursing homes right now. Relatives, loved ones being in nursing homes when there are so many threats to their health there. Not to mention how expensive it is to have someone in, in a healthcare facility. One of the things that you need to realize is that when you go into a healthcare facility, even if your parents are the benefit or getting the benefits of government assistance in a healthcare facility, their home, all of their assets will be tapped into by the federal government before they start helping you. And so if you haven't transferred that wealth or those assets to you five years before, they are going to be a subject, they're going to be subject to withdrawing the money and paying it. Basically it's coming out of that that inheritance that they were going to give to you. One of the ways to avoid it, obviously, is to keep them in your home. Sell that home outright. Don't have to be in a nursing home and don't have to use that wealth for that reason. You can use it to give them better care. And so that is one of the reasons we're seeing that people are remodeling now. They are thinking about keeping their parents with them and have in-house health care if needed. Now, the government does assist with that. And, and of course, you want to transfer those assets for that also. Uh, five years before. So do it now if you need to have things gifted to you now or given to you now so that those things are out of the system for five years. But nevertheless, no matter what your circumstances are, sometimes you, you just can't wait. You've got to get them in there and make a really big decision. Remodeling and adding on to a home can happen very quickly. It can, uh, it can really, really add a lot of value to your home. And of course, all that money that you would be paying to have someone living at another place um, is, is just money that can be put into an asset that can be turned around and tapped into later also. So aging parents, uh, the inhabitants of that home, adding them to that home, you know, that changes the number of people living in a home. Uh, children that are leaving home are, com are coming back home, which has happened a lot. That's another reason you're increasing the number of people living in homes. That's a big reason to remodel right now in 2021. Also, the aging of those inhabitants. If they're already there, but they're getting older and they're susceptible to more injuries and disabilities can occur, then that universal design is an excellent way to remodel a home to keep it usable for all people living in it. And uh, I'm a universal design certified professional and so are others in our offices. And of course, we've got architectural degrees, interior design degrees, cabinet design, all of these things that are helpful to you 
when you get ready to make the changes in your home. You'll get it done the best if you call KM Builders. One of the things we do on all of our homes is uh, encourage people to get it professionally clean. Now, there's a little bit of a fee for that, and we'll help you out with that, but the maids are the official remodeling company cleaning service of KM Builders. So I encourage you to call them also at 822-2526 and get $25 off your first clean by using the code KMBuilders and do that at maids.com slash 211 and use KM Builders code for $25 off your first key clean. And we'll be right back to the KM Builders Remodeling Design Show after this break. Newsmax TV, everyone. <clears throat> <clears throat> Hi, Cindy Martinez, Deborah Schultz, and Raymond Moreno. Thank you all for watching. This is neat. I get to see who's watching me. Didn't get to see that usually. I think Morgan's going to check on me now. Cheryl Cage Borlack, Lynette Calvetti, Cheryl Hugley. Hello to every one of you. Cheryl Woosley. Isn't modern technology incredible?
Welcome back to the KM Builders Remodeling and Design Show. I'm Keith, along with no one today. Morgan is not here, and we're playing on, we're rolling on. She's busy today, having to take care of some things, but we're glad you're with us, and you, we will take your calls live if you'd like to ask any questions about remodeling at 737-1200. That's 210-737-1200. And we'll take your calls live. We are talking about reasons to remodel in 2021. Hopefully you're thinking about what you're going to do and some of the bigger goals. A lot of people are setting goals. Why not set a goal about how you want to live in your home? You've probably learned a lot more about living at home in 2020. So some of the things we've already talked about is that life has changed for us like we've never seen it before of what we're doing from home, the way we're working from home, how many people are living at home with us. Even the thought of elderly parents living in nursing homes has, has changed a lot for many people. <clears throat> so that could mean remodeling is in your future or should be in your future to take care of these things. And the sooner you get on board with the idea of even just getting some good advice, the sooner you can make better informed decisions and the sooner you can make those those uh, decisions come about to fruition. And so I offer you the opportunity to meet with me personally. I meet every one of you personally, and I enjoy it very much. Really enjoy discussing the pros and cons of all different pro, you know, projects, ideas that you might have and want to bounce off of me. I would love that opportunity. And all you do is call 680-5626, and I will be at your home. We'll make an appointment. Uh, this is not something we should rush, obviously. I don't try to do that. I don't try to hard sell you. I don't even try to sell you at all. I just want to be of advice to you and help you to make really good decisions, give you a lot of information, and everybody is always very surprised at how much information comes out of these meetings. And it's because we have a lot of experience. I have a lot of experience in being able to help folks. I'm not interested in trying to... Uh, force something that is not a good fit. I am only interested in, interested in helping you do what works for you. And I really don't care what that is. If that's what works for you, I'll be glad to show you the pros and cons and as well as the costs and any other ramifications of a project, whether you, no matter what you need. Usually there's a fit for everyone if they, if they want to. Some people decide to wait. Some people decide to do it in their next home. Some people decide to sell you know, their homes and, and upgrade and whatever works because you, you need to make a decision that's best for you. There's no way I'm going to, I feel that I'm powerful enough to change your mind about what you want to do. All I can do is cement that if you're, if you're thinking that you, you don't know whether you want to move or stay, you're going to know more after we talk about what, what to expect out of, each, out of uh, the remodeling. And so I'm not going to be able to change your mind. I'm just going to give you good information. And you'll know what you want to do after that. And so we don't sell on these visits. We just give information. We tell you about the process and what would be involved if you did decide to go forward. And then you let us know, usually at a later time, what you'd like to do. So I think you'll really like the relaxed approach, uh, the friendly discussion that takes place, the information that is transferred in these visits. As we said, there are many reasons to remodel in 2021, starting with life has changed. Another reason is, is you might just want to change. You might just want more space. You may, you may have gotten tired of seeing things the way they are, and you want some inspiration in your life. You would like to freshen things up. You want to change. And sometimes that means you need more space. Sometimes it means utilize, utilizing space more wisely than it's being utilized right now. That is one thing that we are very good at is making sure that folks can, uh, that you can learn where your wasted space is at and how we can take advantage of that. Could be in just in hallways or in additional storage areas or in areas that, that are just uh, not seen by you. Attics, uh, closets, hallways, like we said lots of spaces that can be joined and and these are really really 
interesting to see what can be done in these situations. And I know you'll enjoy seeing this as we discuss them. And then you've got some decisions to make. But, but that is one reason that people are wanting to remodel in 2021. They want more space. That might mean a room addition, or like we said, it might just mean combining rooms, maybe maybe uh, getting rid of some, some rooms' functions and changing those functions. Another one is to modern and up, update. You need a change. You're going to get many benefits out of updating. You're going to have more comfort. You're going to have more, perhaps, savings on energy efficiency. Um, a lot of these things will just cost you more later if you don't change out these things. But, but um, that is something that is really worth entertaining is why, how much am I spending on utility bills when I, if I remodel, I could take care of that. Let's go ahead and take a caller. Mike, if you're there, I would love to talk to you. How can I help you, Mike? Okay, um, my question is, um, I'm looking at purchasing a home here in the near future. It's going to need some upgrade and remodeling to it on the on the purchase side. Do you require payment up front or a deposit up front? Because I'd be buying this house with hard money, and and so I'd be looking at needing the repairs prior to uh, getting it moved in, like renovations and such. Are you asking me if, if I'll do it all, do all the work before you pay me anything? Is that what you're asking? Uh, I'm a, what is your, pro, do you require a deposit prior to starting the job? Is that how you work? Yes, normally we require 10% down to get it scheduled. Um, it's, just, it's just good business to put, to put something into it before it starts. We have a lot of uh, wheels we have to put into motion and uh, plans and drawings and so forth that we have to get going before we start. And so we ask for 10%, and that also gets us uh, started ordering products, which is very needed if we're going to keep it on a good schedule. Okay, and approximately how long? Well, I guess you wouldn't know without seeing the project. You couldn't answer that question. I was going to ask, approximately how long uh, does it normally take you to complete, a, say, a full house rehab project? I guess without seeing it, you couldn't answer that too well, could you? Well, that's, I, I could, if you could tell me a couple of things, like how big is the house? You already said it was a whole house remodel. So how old is the house and how big is it? Okay, it's uh, 78, it was built in 78 and then it's uh, approximately 1,400 square foot. So 1,400 square foot home is probably going to be somewhere between three, three months a whole home remodel, three months to four months, depending on how elaborate and how detailed it is. But I've done, you know, many projects, whole home remodels in four months or under. But I would say that's probably a, a barometer somewhere around three, four months. Might be, it might be closer to three. It just depends on, that's a fairly, you know, smaller home for us to, to do a whole house remodel. You might be hitting closer to three months. Okay, that's great information. Um, and I, of course, I, I can uh, contact you on your website, and I, I guess I need to schedule you to come out and look at it at the property and then make the decisions with you. Yeah, that would be the best. Let's get together as soon as we can. And if you look at and you're, you're hot to go on this, you tell them I need an earlier appointment. But call me at 680-5626, and if you're driving or something, it's 680-KMCO. And uh, website is kmbuilders.com, and I would love to meet you and go over it so that you could start getting, you know, uh, your affairs in order and know what's next, give you an outline of steps to take uh, so that you're not losing any valuable time. Uh, excellent, and uh, yes, we do miss Morgan and, and enjoy. She's the, the color analyst on the show, so we do miss her, but <laughs> still a great show anyway. Thank you. Well, I really appreciate that. That is a great description of her, isn't it? Thank you. Have a great day. Thanks for calling the show. And I look forward to meeting you. And Mike, thanks again. And so you can call the show just like that. I'd love to talk to you. And we'll be, we'll be uh, taking a break now. But I want to mention one of our sponsors that I have used at my home, like usual. And that is Elite Lighting Designs. They're at EliteLightingDesigns.com. What a beautiful difference on the outside of my home at night. Take a look at them. Of course, 
Um, they do holiday lighting and all that too, but call them at 573-0594, 210-573-0594 or EliteLightingDesigns.com. We'll be right back to the KM Builders Remodeling and Design Show. This is News
Welcome back to the KM Builders Remodeling and Design Show. I'm Keith, and Morgan is out taking care of business, personal business today. We let her go. And since I did this show for so many years without her, I'm going to try to do it again. And it's great to see all of you watching on Facebook. That is not something I used to do until Morgan came along. And like Mike said, our color analyst is out today. But uh, thank you for for joining us and we are taking your calls live at 737-1200 or 1-800-383-WOAI. Again, that local number is 210-737-1200. And glad to talk to you. We were talking about reasons to remodel. Life has changed, uh, particularly reasons to remodel in 2021 because of so many things we've learned in 2020, right? About staying home, about the way we like or dislike our homes, uh, great interest rates right now and uh, prices of new homes are just really going up fast and a lot of times we don't want to pay that full mortgage. We don't mind paying a little more for some things we want, but do you really want to pay that full mortgage uh, on a brand new house? Or are you thinking about, you know what, I can put a little more into this one and I can get some of the features that I really want. I like a lot of things about my home. But I don't want to buy a whole new home just to get a few things that I want. And really, most homes, you know, the bedrooms are fine. You might need new flooring throughout, new paint. But that's just something you've got to do anyway. That's maintenance. That's not really um, something you would think about as an expense. That has to be done anyway. And you're going to have to do it with you if you sell the home. So now look at the other specialty projects that you might want, like a new kitchen, or, and some new bathrooms. And really then, if you do those things, your home is, is like a new home with some new flooring, some new paint, and a new bathroom and a new kitchen, then you've got a brand new home. Now, if you, you need maintenance items on the outside, you need a new roof, you need garage doors, you need painting, well, you're gonna have to do those anyway, so don't even count that cost in to whether you should stay in your home. Because remember, you're gonna have to do those things if you sell anyway, or take a beating on it. You don't wanna do that. So don't look at it all as one big, one big um, amount of money you gotta pay. You need to look at what would it take to make you happy to stay in your home, you know, without the maintenance costs. The maintenance costs are gonna have to be spent anyway. Now here's a good thing that you might like to know is that a lot of these projects will take care of some of these maintenance issues anyway. Let's say the grout or the tile is leaking, the grout in the shower, or the glass is leaking or the faucets are leaking, leaking, the cabinets need repair, the kitchen cabinets need repair, the finishes are bad, the sinks are, are bad, your tub has a stain, it won't come out. I mean, you can go on and on about the maintenance things that you'd like to take care of, that you're getting tired of taking care of, and that you were going to have to take care of, but you don't have to take care of now because you're going to get it remodeled. And a lot of you are really smart about that. When I come out, you say, please excuse this or that because I haven't wanted to fix it because we knew we were going to remodel. And that makes perfect sense. Don't put money into something that you're about to change anyway. Save that cost. Put it toward the remodeling. Again, maintenance is a good reason to go ahead and remodel anyway. You're going to have to do it. You're going to have to fix it. Why not get it better than it was? Why not have it in a way that makes you really proud of it now instead of just hmm, maybe not so, maybe taking care of, a, of an issue. Don't just take care of an issue. Go ahead and make it something beautiful. So that is one of the good reasons to remodel in 21, 2021. Take care of your maintenance issues. What about safety and uh, making something safer and more energy efficient like we said earlier? Making it more practical, a better working kitchen a better closet. These are some of the reasons that people are going to remodel in 2021, and I hope you're one of them. I hope that you are seeing these things could be really cool. Do you have a, I just went and looked at one where they want to redo their, their master bedroom closet. They don't like it. They hate the design. I agree with them. It's not a good design. They've got two closets right back to back, and they want to make it one large closet, and it will look so much more luxurious. And so we talked about a budget of about $10,000 to do it 
And then, of course, some people will spend 15 to 20 on a, on a master closet. Some will spend only five, and that's okay too. But this particular one's probably going to be around a $10,000 budget, and it's going to be incredible. But that's, that's a wonderful project to change your life. Again, these remodels that we're talking about are really are life-changing. They make a difference to people year after year after year. And remember, they are a great return on investment. A little thing that I, that I go by when I meet with you is I don't give you any suggestions that you should do this project unless it would be something that I would do myself if I owned that home. That doesn't mean that we never do um, a project that I wouldn't recommend we do them because that's what the client wants. But if they're asking me whether, whether you should uh, do this project for return on investment, is it a good value or not, I'm going to tell you the truth. And then you can decide whether you want to do it anywhere or not. But a lot of people don't care about whether it's a return on investment, but a lot of people do. And that's, that's what we need to know. If you're interested in that, we are definitely going to help you know what I would do if it were my home. And, and I do buy a home. I have a home that's going to be for sale in the spring. So that is what kind of like, well, what would I have done if that were my home and I were going to resell it? And so, so that's, that's some of the advice we give you right there in person. And modernizing your home, updating it, because you need a change is definitely one of the reasons to remodel in 2021. And one of the things I'm doing is getting some things fixed on my car in 2021. If you have some rock chips like I do on my Hellcat, I want it to look brand new. I want that thing to be in mint condition. And you might be like me. You may have some things you want fixed on your car. Go to Frank's Paint and Body Shop. Frank does incredible work for the Lexus dealer here. He does work for other dealers. And Frank is at 210-927-3410. Be sure you mention that KM Builders recommended that Keith at KM Builders recommended Frank Menchaca, Frank's Paint and Body Shop at 927-3410. And you can always ask me. And we're going to take a break now. We'll be right back to the KM Builders Remodeling and Design Show. Remodeling can get...
Welcome back to the KM Builders Remodeling Design Show. I think I recognize that song as being our lead in. Some of them, you know, hard to tell. <laughs> you think it's, is that a commercial or is that a lead in? It sounds the same in our studio. It's hard to tell the difference sometimes, but Dave does a great job back there. And we're glad to be with you on the show. And you can get in a call at 737-1200. I'd love to take your call. We've had Mike call in and it was a really great question. And I think he got more information than he expected there. I was able to help him a little more than he thought. And so that usually is the case with a few questions. And of course, a lot of you just listen and you plan on meeting me in person. And I really appreciate that opportunity. And all of you who are on Facebook, thanks so much for watching and listening. And y'all can join us anytime on Facebook. We have several things that go on on Instagram and Facebook during the week. We show videos of houses in, of course, Sarah does a great job of posting blogs at our office and just really interesting. We have a newsletter too that comes out every week and it's just really informative as well. And it's brief but very informative and Morgan does that one. And that is at friends at kmbuilders.com. You can get subscribed there at friends at kmbuilders.com and we'll get you set up. A lot of you know exactly what's happening in the company and in the industry because we keep you informed and you learn a lot and you have a lot of uh, feedback for these things. We, we love meeting you in person. I, I'm still the one, believe it or not, that goes out and meets every client on the first, first call. And I truly enjoy doing that. I changed my life around on a few years ago to where I could go to every one of them and the business is doing even better because I have the management taking care of those things and I'm getting to do what I enjoy the most. Morgan said, when she went out with me, she saw why I enjoy it so much and how I was in my element. And I think that's really true. Um, and I know that we just have great conversations with y'all about your projects. You know, like, like we're talking about today, about reasons to remodel. We've said that life has changed in 2020. So there's a lot of reasons to remodel in 2021, including we need updates. We may have people moving in. We may need more space. We may not want to move relatives into nursing homes or assisted living anymore. Uh, savings on energy costs are a good one. Savings on, I mean, actually making it for safety are great, great ones. Comfort, usability, temperature, you know, the, the roominess that we need. Organization is a great reason. Modernize and update. A good return on investment. It's, it's all, let's we'll talk a little bit just about the money part of it. Remodeling is one of those things when done wisely, you will be paid back for. It's just a matter of whether it's gonna to be today or in a few years. You're gonna get paid back for it. It's money in the bank. And um, another thing is interest rates are really low so you can get more for your money. And also, you know, it's a lot less to put out than what you would be putting in a payment on a, let's say a million dollar home because you want that million dollar kitchen. You may spend 75000 to get that, that beautiful kitchen that you saw in a, in a million dollar home, but you're not going to spend a million dollars to get that whole house. You're just going to get those features that you really want. And that can be done with remodeling. And that's a reason to remodel in 2021. How about the lower taxes that you don't have to pay, uh, the higher taxes you don't have to pay when you move into a bigger home? A lot of times we, we could think about, well, I could make the payment, get the house that I want. But if you thought about what the taxes and insurance are going to cost you and what it costs to, to pay your realtor and the cost of a move, these are real expenses that can be avoided by remodeling. And of course, as most of you know, we can remodel while you still live there. That is not a problem. And so we want to give you even more reasons and ways and ideas to think about in remodeling your home in 2021. I, for one, want to meet you. I would love for you to schedule an appointment at kmbuilders.com. There's a place where you can log in and even do a virtual appointment if you're concerned about meeting in person. And we have a schedule on there that you can, you can fill out yourself. We also can, can get you into videos and to all the different aspects of our website. You can talk to me personally if you'd like to text message me, and I'll be able to help you. But get that appointment scheduled for 2021 and start planning now. At least get your information so that I can help you make a good, informed decision. 
I really want to help you in 2021. I hope you will also contact our sponsor, BioGreen, which is a great one, Joe Caccino at BioGreenSA.com. If you have any questions about any of our sponsors, just call us at 680-KMCO. That's also found at KMBuilders.com. Have a great weekend, everybody. Thank y'all.